Washington had never looked more beautiful than Mary and me. The lilacs bursting on their branches outside the White House. The air fragrant with their blossoms. The promise of a new spring. Our first spring in four years without war. Today is Friday. Good Friday, as a matter of fact. Now, post-war, we still have important matters to address. But tonight, tonight is a time of renewal of relaxation. So, when Mary finally finishes dressing, she and I are going to go to Ford's Theater to see a play. Now, one of the most important problems we must quickly solve is to reestablish our public's trust and confidence in our currency. Counterfeiting is widespread. In fact, it threatens our entire economy. So I was pleased when Hugh McCullough, who I appointed our recent Treasury Secretary just a few weeks back, stopped by today to see me about that problem. He said he believes that fully one-third of our greenbacks are now forgeries. Think of that. One out of every three dollars, a fake. Fortunately, he also brought me a solution to the problem. He suggested that Congress create a division in the Treasury Department devoted solely to ferreting out these counterfeiters. He uh, left me a copy of the legislation he proposes. It's on my desk. Tomorrow I'll study it in detail. But I told him straight out, I thought it was an excellent idea. And I told him to go see Vice President Johnson right away and ask him to start rounding up votes among his friends in Congress. As Secretary McCullough was leaving, I asked him, what are these counterfeit fighters going to be called? He said, the Secret Service. The Secret Service. I like that. Well, time to go. Mary is getting late. <laughs> <laughs>